Yane comes in with a $50 donation, says, Smooth Operative is back. Don't forget to remind Scent how to pronounce Lara. <laughs> Alrighty, guys, and with that, we are going to go ahead and toss it over to Smooth Operative running Lara Croft Tomb Raider Legend. Take it away. All right, you guys. It's like 7 in the morning. Are you ready for some Tomb Raider? Yeah. Woo! <laughs> My name is Smooth Operative. Thank you so much for joining us today at SGDQ 2019, benefiting Doctors Without Borders, powered by Twitch. Perlux, I remembered if you're here. Um, that is Mr. Maxi Lobes, uh, my speedrunning godfather. So say hi, Maxi. Hi. <laughs> and my hello. hype women, uh, Catlink and Nikasaur. So <laughs> hey. thank you all for being here. Thank you guys for waking up so early or staying up very late for my run. The last one. And um, yeah, I'm, I'm ready to start the game when you guys are. So want to count it down? All right. All right. Three. Three. Two, Two, one, one go! go. All right, so the big thing with this game is uh, something called air walking, and you'll be seeing me do a lot of it. <laughs> I um, did kind of mess this beginning up, so let's, let's just okay. talk about the air walk for a second. Um, basically, I have to draw Lara's weapons and Come on, girl. You got this. You got, you got to come on, girl. Oh, she's having a time this morning. OK, <laughs> this is fine. <laughs> this is fine. All right, so I have to stumble like that and draw her weapons at the same time. So we're going to try this again. All right, there we go. <laughs> there we go. Wow. And I'll be using this in a couple of different places to gain some height. So like this, for instance. And uh, we are at our first boss, the rope. <laughs> so oh, here oh, we boy. go. <laughs> All right, oh, yeah. Yeah. easy bus. That's a major reset. <laughs> not get that wrong. But um, we're going to be air walking all over the place and using backflips to kind of gain some height as well, go over these waterfalls. Um, one thing to mention, I am using something uh, control-wise called advanced hold. So if I let go of my right mouse button or the directions, uh, she's going to fall out of air walk, and that's what we do not want. So. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> We're going to have to keep an eye on her, I guess. But, yeah. So, Lara, the entire premise of this game is Lara and her mother crash landed. Uh, their plane crash landed in Nepal, and her mother has disappeared through like a magical, mystical portal. And so, Lara's kind of on a mission throughout this entire game to, to find her. So, um, there is kind of some clues here in Bolivia, and that's what we're trying to do. Uh, I got to get this. Uh, okay, good. I have to get the uh, load, the level, the rest of the level to load by going into that um, load, uh, level yeah. loader there. So we kind of want to hit uh, some chick, uh, some triggers. Triggers, thank yeah. you. Yeah, there you go. Trigger points. There's another one here coming up where uh, the level's like deloaded, so I have to kind of like go in here. There we go. Yeah. Nice. There, nice. All right. Some of them are harder than others, but um, the next one coming up can be a challenge sometimes. But we're gonna go with it. All right. And if you hear uh, someone talking to Lara in her headset, she has two assistants back at the Croft Manor, uh, Zip and Alistair. Zip is her tech man, and Alistair is her research man. So that's who those people will be. She's kind of more realistic with... Yeah. <laughs> not her just yeah. by herself. Yeah, I actually really love her character in this game. All right, let's see if we can get this uh, trigger. Uh, okay, good. I have to be really careful there because there is a quick time event that can occur if I go too far into that section. But uh, we, we got it. We, we got to. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay, so we are coming up pretty soon on the end of this level. And then we'll be doing a big fight scene. Ooh. There's a helicopter. It's kind of cool. <laughs> All right. So in this scene, you don't really see it, but there is um, a woman that looks a lot similar to uh, Lara's best friend in college here. And she sees her for just a quick second before she disappears. And that would be um, Amanda. She's with uh, another gentleman, Rutland, who we'll see again later. But <laughs> I just have to 
kill these guys here. There's eight of them, I think. Yeah. There's eight yeah. of them, and it, we can't go anywhere without killing them first. Yeah, so that is uh, the pedestal that is believed to be the key to kind of, or the, the lock, of un <laughs> un unlocking, but. All right, so this mysterious woman is around. Uh, there's another mysterious woman. Say hi to Anaya. Anaya! 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 Anaya. <laughs> <laughs> Mara and Anaya were also friends in college, and she's gonna help her uh, uncover some secrets as to what maybe happened to Amanda. So that's why we are back in Peru. And I'm gonna need to get some grenades here to, uh, to help me with the next section. It may look like I have three grenades when we load into this uh, motorcycle sequence, but um, I don't, I have one. <laughs> yeah, and we need at least four. Um, well, for for yeah. some bosses, yeah. For the, for the next section coming up, we'll need at least one. So yeah. oh, that's all I grabbed. Hopefully it's good enough, but. <laughs> Um, so this section is um, kind of an auto-scroller. I know you guys love those. Um, but I can actually crash this bike on accident sometimes. So um, hopefully that doesn't happen. Um, I'm going to have to kill a certain number of enemies in order to proceed. Otherwise, this will just loop forever and ever, and Lara will never escape. So we can't have that. But. Um, you basically just want to get as close to the enemies as possible so that they die faster, and then you'll get good bike RNG. So we're coming up on our first enemy here. Uh, let's see if we get it. Okay, he died pretty quickly. That's what you generally want. So there should be two more coming up behind her. Okay, there we go. I hear the bikes. Get yeah. your sour please in the chat. Yeah. yeah. Peru has a banging soundtrack. Yeah, we know. <laughs> oh, yeah. You can't see us. We're dancing, actually. <laughs> I better not look around. <laughs> no, don't. Just trust in us. We are totally boogieing. There's also another thing in, uh, in these uh, motorcycle sections. Sometimes propane tanks will spawn, and sometimes they won't. It's better if you can get them to spawn because it will take... Oh, and also there's weird physics. Anyway, uh, it will take them out pretty quickly if you can get them. So I'll be looking out for those coming up. But um, otherwise, AJ, if you have any donations, feel free to read them now. Oh, yeah, we got plenty. We have $200 from Whoa, Flux Monkey. Flux Monkey. Oh, oh yeah, Flux good old Flux. roller. Let's go. Flux going in. And he just says, <laughs> Frog Ducati. <laughs> Frog <Yeah>. Ducati. <laughs> I, I hope you guys can see that in the chat because Frog Ducati is the winner. <laughs> Thank you, Flux. We miss you. And we have uh, another $100 from Craig. Hey! hey. So, Thank you, Craig. <laughs> glad to see Tippy back at GDQ. She's the best, though. I'm the best, though. No, you're the best, though. Thank you so much for your donation. Shall I keep some roll rolling? R roll yeah. Oh, yeah. oh yeah. <laughs> All right. We got seventy-five dollars from Leon. No comment. But thank you so much for the donation. Thank you so much. Oh boy. We got twenty-five dollars from someone that says, or someone's name listed as someone AJ knows. With the, <laughs> I wonder who that could I be. Wonder. With the, oh hi. With a comment says, hey, AJ, never thought I'd tune into GDQ and see you commentating. Can you guess who this is? Here are some hints. I'm better than you at Windjammers. I still can't believe you're older than me. Your Fix-It Felix interview is hilarious and will never die in my heart. I play Red Wolf and Vampire Savior. I'm still better than you at Windjammers. If you can't guess, it's Pat, man. Love this event, and you are a great addition. I've always been impressed with your energy, and it's awesome that you're putting it to such good use. Keep up the good work no matter what you do. P.S. Windjammers 2 sometime? Yeah, catch these hands, man. Thank you for the novel. Yeah, right? <laughs> that was something. Thank you so much for your donation. We have a $250 donation. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. From Your Logs ASE says, had to donate for one of my favorite Lara Croft games. Good luck on your run. Thank you. All right, you can stop now. Thank you. Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Shut, shut. <laughs> All right, so we're coming up on the end of... Uh, the motorcycle sequence. Got to take a quick look at these breathtaking mountains. And uh, these boxes are going to attack me. But we got to take, take out these guys, and then I'm going to actually let this, this uh, scene play out. Uh, yeah, I got to get the... You guys, you guys just got to see this. It's action-packed. So that's Anaya. Hey, girl. Anaya. 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 <laughs> 
Yeah. That's slow motion, too. Oh, yeah. And she lands on her feet. Very smug. <laughs> nice job, lady. Nice job. Easy. Easy. <laughs> All right, so Anaya's going to drop us off uh, actually at the dig site where we lost our friend Amanda. And here I'm going to be kind of in a flashback sequence. That's why there's this horrible film grain. <laughs> it, I mean, yeah, it's pretty bad. Sorry. But um, the difference here is that uh, the airwalk. Oh. Uh, hi, Sarah. <laughs> anyway, the difference is that the uh, air walk only lasts for a few seconds because she does not have pistols uh, to hold the air walk. So I'm going to have to, I only have like maybe a few seconds to get these uh, done. So I'm going to be trying to do some swag strats here. <laughs> we'll see if we can do it. This is Kent. Oh, Kent. Uh, it's her! It's her. Uh -oh. oh, he's excited. Uh -oh. Bye, Kent. Bye, Kent. Bye, Kent. Bye. Oh, oh, oh. oh. oh okay. Girl, you better run. Swag strats. <laughs> Save us. So, yeah, the problem with this uh, is that the camera is really weird, so we'll see if I can get it. If not, no big deal. All right, so I've got to set this up. All right, one, two, three. Yes! Hey, oh, hey! There we go! All right, that's what we wanted. Okay, good. Very well done. I'm happy we made that. <laughs> it saves only a little bit of time, but it does look really cool, in my opinion. All right, so miss that uh, airwalk. We're gonna just take the... We're gonna just take the thing here. And this will be the end of the uh, flashback. So you'll see uh, what happened. Amanda's, like, I don't know, drowning or something, and so she thinks... She thinks she's dead, but we're we're back in the present time and we're gonna go explore and see what we can find. So obligatory swimming uh, level guys. I don't know. <laughs> There's always one section I think where swimming is horrible. Swimming controls are always just so finicky. <laughs> oh yeah, they're bad. Just keep swimming, just keep swimming. I, I knew you were going to do that. <laughs> I'm I sorry. I knew it. I couldn't help myself. Yes. Hi, <laughs> woman. If you give her enough time, she'll just start singing, so. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so I'm going to take a quick breath here, and then uh, we're going to pick up these orbs. 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 <laughs> uh, there's four of them, so here's the second one. Oh. oh. Go. And the last one. Can you, get, you guys got the energy? Orb! <laughs> Thank you. All right, so that took the water level down. So, yay. We're going to try to um, get back in airwalk real quick, like. It's the same story. A youth unaware of his royal blood rises from obscurity. So I have to be careful here because um, there is actually a quick time event that you can accidentally run into. So I'll be kind of taking the right side of this to avoid that because, to be honest, I don't remember the controls for it. So <laughs> I think it's like up, down, but yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna get these boulders out. And I'll be trying to put these on two pressure plates. Okay, just, so. just shoot them. It's Hopefully yeah. that will get over there. I, <laughs> yeah. I'm not totally sure, but it looks like it's kind of... Oh, 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 they stopped short. <laughs> That's all right. No big deal. I'll get the other one, too. Oh. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> just works, I guess. <laughs> Hashtag just works. Yeah, I didn't hit this enough times, so that's why it didn't go into the pressure plate. That was my fault. I wasn't counting. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so now that these are both um, in, I'm going to be trying to get this boulder down with a precisely put grenade. Shout outs to a uh, random pink bunny for showing me that setup. <laughs> Thank you, girl. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. You Ooh, and. Oh, oh, that, oh. oh I was, that happens sometimes. Sorry. Go on. <laughs> okay. Anyway. All right. Oh, it's fine. Nope. Right. Terrified. Done now. <laughs> it's over. Uh, you, this was the first time I saw you do that run. You did a uh, race with, uh, for Frame Fatales, 
and you did, you raced with Random Pink Bunny, right? Yep, we had a race for Frame for Towels and it was a lot of fun, so. That was the first time I saw you run the game and it was amazing. <laughs> So at least I'm familiar with it now. It was actually a pretty intense race, too. It was? Yeah. It was fun. That was a fun race. Mm -hmm. All right, so we're making our escape. I wasn't keeping track of a knife. Okay, good. And then we're going to activate the airwalk here on this side. Now, a really scary thing that can happen is that um, now that we're kind of airwalking in a little bit of a dangerous place, uh, these guys can sometimes knock her out of the air with... Uh, their, you know, their guns. They could shoot her out of the air. So that's what we don't want to happen. So I'm going to try really hard to um, avoid that, if, if possible. <laughs> yeah. And we'll initiate another airwalk. And yeah, so, I don't know. Bless. <laughs> Bless. Don't shoot me, please. <laughs> please don't shoot. All right, nice. Hey. That's good RNG. There we go. I really like the bongos in the background. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's, it's cool. <laughs> the enemies have a bit of a weird collision, but that guy just got bodied. See ya, nerd. Bunker cat. <laughs> All right. So we're going to kill these guys, and uh, I'm going to try to pick up a couple of grenades here just to make this go by a little bit. Faster, uh, camo. Yeah, so. Whoop, I don't know if that one will reach him. Oh, that's okay. Oh, that guy can oh, hear walk too. Wow. Nice one, dude. Oh, hello. I, to tell you the truth, I don't actually know how many of these guys are. I just, it's more of a feeling. There's enough. <laughs> All right. I'm going to try to do a side roll up here. Okay. Oh, nice. Someone's coming. Just so I can, there's one more enemy that spawns and he tries to shoot Anaya and we can't have that. So get out of here, sir. Anaya's there, I promise. You just can't see her. She's invisible right now. I like how Laro's also just standing there. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So that is the end of Peru and we are on our way to Japan. So Lara's gonna make her grand entrance here, and uh, she just got her hair done. Oh, her, her hair is all that in a bag of chips. <laughs> just got her hair done. Doctor uh, Nvidia Hair Works, ready to show off the masterpiece. Let's go. <laughs> Tippy, I got a donation. I got to read just for you for that comment. Shoot. It's from Doctor Nvidia Hair Works. Oh, yes. get it. <laughs> And it's yeah. for five hundred dollars. The doctor is in. And it says, "Thanks for your constant support of my work. Good luck on the run." <laughs> oh, we are in very much in support of Doctor Nvidia Hairworks. Thank you. Thank you. Looks great, girl. All right, so she's uh, meeting with a friend, Nishimura, and uh, he's letting her know that there is a bad man here and he has a piece of uh, Excalibur that she needs so we're going to be fighting through his goons to kind of try and get that piece back so he's actually at the penthouse across the way oh okay. oh nice <laughs> uh, I typically you typically want to kill these guys like over here so that two more don't spawn oh Nishimura peak <laughs> Hey, guy. So, yeah, um, we got lucky there. I was in a good position, and the other two guys didn't spawn. Just a little bit faster. Yeah. yeah. Oh, my mouse is doing something weird. Come here. <laughs> it's, it's trying to run off. I, I had to install my weird mouse and my $10 keyboard for this run, so <laughs> doing good. <laughs> I also love that once things get really crazy and shots start going off, she takes off her shoes and puts up her hair. That's how you know that she means business. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's a crime to keep a bike like that locked up on a roof. All right. The red Ducati, you don't actually get to ride it in the speed run, but I have to kind of show it off a little bit. That's why it's on the uh, frog Ducati. <laughs> All right, so we're going to try to get through these guys without getting knocked over. Um, Japan is really bad for that in that uh, when when Lara's trying to go and through the whole level, they always want to like kick her down and stuff and it, it just wastes time, so we'll try to avoid that if at all possible. <laughs> okay. Alright, so gotta grapple this gigantic screen here. 
shoot off these. And try not to get hit too many times. <laughs> there we go. Uh, oh, oh, come on. Yeah. All right. <laughs> so if I uh, draw my weapon and I backflip into this door, she doesn't have to open it. Just She just goes right through it. Small time save, but... It's the little things. Yeah. Right. <laughs> this is the big platforming section, so um, uh, we'll see how it goes. Got this. It's uh, sometimes frustrating in certain places, but we'll see how it goes, yeah. Might have to do some quick math, but that's okay. Yeah. I um, shot down that with the gun because then it will prevent me from having to grapple later, so... Oh, okay. I was trying to do another air walk, but it, she doesn't want she doesn't want to. So, girl. Oh, oh. That was my. Oh. Ooh. She's hey, girl. <laughs> <laughs> she's, saying, she's saying saying hey and stuff. How's it going? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just relaxing. <laughs> this is fine, actually. All right. So give me a second here. Please don't look down. Heights don't bother me, Alistair. All right, so we got the airwalk. Got up. the airwalk on that go. jump. That was nice. nice. Yeah. <laughs> I have to count it so I know where she's at. Uh, Thank you. <laughs> smooth. All right. Yeah, these will snap off if I take too long, so we got to get out of here. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Let me in. <laughs> Let me in, you bad man. All right. Oh, so I'm going to knock these guys out with the chandelier. Pick up the shotgun. And we are almost to Takamoto, the boss. I just have to take out a few more dudes here. So I'm gonna use another grenade here to take out this window. Normally you'd have to use like the uh, dragon that you see there in, the, in this scene, but don't have to do that because yay, new stress. All right, so same thing I'm gonna backflip into the uh, elevator door and we are on our way. <laughs> <laughs> it just looks so ridiculous. Who needs to open the door the regular way? Just right, backflip yeah. into it. <laughs> yeah. So with Takamoto, uh, I'm going to have to try and stun him a bit with my grenade and we can have one of two options. Okay, he's not floating in midair, so sometimes he does that, but I'm going to have to use the uh, grappling hook to kind of get him to stop doing his attack, basically, and trying to, like, do this. Basically like a stun lock. Yeah. Right. Otherwise, he likes to travel. All right, wait. That was, okay. that was good. That was good. That was a that good, was good fight, good. actually, yeah. He was, beha he was behaving himself. All right. So now we are in Ghana, and we are going to see a beautiful waterfall. Time to go sightseeing. Yeah. yeah. It happens occasionally. And I'll have to do a kind of a fall damage cancel here. I'll be using my grapple as well. So I have to line it up and um, jump, swap my weapon, and grapple all in like a quick movement. So I don't know, pray for me here. <laughs> all right. And that was yeah, nice. Got it. There we go. That's decent. <laughs> I'll take it. This section is actually deloaded. So, um,. Where are you? <laughs> <laughs> you can make it uh, loaded again if I die, but I don't want that, so. All right, it looks like we're going to make it through. It just goes back to normal once you make it to this. Very thing. nice. There we wow. go. That was good. Yeah. All right, I'm going to go for the swag strats. Okay, I didn't get it, but uh, you can actually initiate air walk right after <laughs> you uh, grapple there. And it looks really cool, but it's not a big deal because I can always set it up right here, which is... Um, the older strats. All right, there we go. Sorry, you walked right past that guy. He had no idea that you were there. <laughs> He's like, why? Where, where? I, I have no idea what's going on anymore. <laughs> Dude never seen a woman in his life. <laughs> People are walking on air in darkness. I don't get it. Hey, oh, it's Faith. 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 Every cat in this game is Faith, so just spam it. Faith in chat. Faith GDQ chat. Faith. GDQ Faith. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Candy. Is that the cry of faith? Yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, now it is. Yeah, I think it is now. <laughs> it's canon. All right, so we're coming up on Rutland. Uh, 
I have to stun lock him with some grenades, so I have four. Looks like he's going to be a good boy. Hey! <laughs> hey. That, was very quick. that was really quick. Wow. Yeah, that was a good one. Thank you. <laughs> Rutland was a good boy. All right, so now we are in Kazakhstan, and uh, we are going to be doing something similar to how we did in Ghana. I have to make a really long, to make a really long drop here. <laughs> Um, normally you would have to kill all of these enemies and sort of make your way to that uh, comms tower, but we're just gonna glide on by. <laughs> just gonna take a nice trip. It's the scenic route. <laughs> I much prefer this route. <laughs> and this is another um, damage fall cancel, so I have to time this right. All right, here we go. Oh, okay. oh. Oof. Oh. I was too late on the uh, the grapple, so that was my fault. So That's we'll try. Okay. We'll try it again. I did mess that up in practice uh, with Miss Catling earlier. <laughs> Maybe it's just me. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, we'll try it again. It really is a beautiful, like, sight from the air. It, I don't oh, think yeah. it was intentionally I like mean, that, but it's yeah. beautiful to look at. It is nice. I'm just trying to show you guys the sights. I mean, yeah, that's all. Taking us on an adventure. Tourism. Exactly. Yeah. I appreciate it. <laughs> all right, let's try this again. All right, there we go. There, there we, go. we got it. All right. So I have to hit that checkpoint and then... Whee! Look at her little feet go. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and then we can go here. Hey, guy. Where are you going? Come back here. Away from your bullets? Oh. I mean... <laughs> I mean, he has bullets, too. He has grenades. Hers are better. <laughs> Not ideal, but um, I have to get to the train, and it's leaving, so we better hurry. Gotta get a move on. Gotta go, oh. gotta go fast. Gotta go fast. Gotta, gotta go fast. You know what's gonna help? <laughs> that Ducati. Ducati. Oh, yeah. Ducati. Real talk, though, uh, if, if there are any uh, financial people from Ducati <laughs> watching, hey, SGDQ. Sponsored by Ducati. <laughs> maybe, maybe for AGDQ we can get a sponsor yeah. from Ducati. <laughs> maybe. So this section works uh, pretty much the same way as it does in Peru on the bikes. Only the music is not as good. Uh, and sometimes uh, you can crash into the tree. Uh, but some of the, sometimes like the collision is missing. So it's really weird. Um, but you, same thing, you want to get as close to these guys as possible so that um, the next set of enemies will spawn and oh, you can continue. That's okay, don't worry about it. There you go. So AJ, this is actually a great time to read donations if you have any. Oh, we have tons. <laughs> All right. Oh, yeah. Oh, thank you. Let's go. Starting off, we got $23 from Lupin the Third. It says, this is all I have left in my bank account, but it's going to an amazing cause. Nice run so far. You got this, Tippy. Thank you. Thank you, Lupin. Aww. We've got uh, $10 from Helen40. says, me and my boyfriend love watching your speed runs. Keep up the good work and greetings from Sweden. Aw, thank you. Alex153. Donates $50, says, Hi, last HEDQ's Tomb Raider 2 run was one of my favorites, and I'm really enjoying this one so far. Keep it up. Thank you. That run is a lot different from this one. Uh, <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, yeah. I would say so, yes. This one's a, a little bit less technical, in my opinion, but um, feel free to continue, AJ. Thank you for your donation. Oh, yeah, we got one here from First Clone. All right. Oh, yeah. $50 says it's 5 a.m. here in Oregon, but I had to donate during Tippy's Legend run. Good luck and... Take Kavar. <laughs> Take, oh, we'll get there. We'll get there. I know. I, I know. <laughs> Have a uh, one hundred and fifty dollar donation Ooh. from oh, Metschman. Says, let's get that Ocarina of Time run happening. Yes, yes, let's. Nice. yes. Ocarina yes. of Time. I need it. That's my runner. That's my runner's choice. So if you do donate during my run, that's going to Ocarina of Time. Jessamy comes in with three hundred and fifty dollars. Ooh. Ooh. Wow. It says, Hype for Tomb Raider. Hype for Tomb Raider. Thank you. Hi. Hi. <laughs> oh, okay. Bye, guy. So uh, in this section, there's actually the introduction of Jeeps. So how about that Jeep sponsorship, hmm? <laughs> <laughs> Got Ducati, Jeep. Yeah. The Jeeps can really mess you up if uh, they're deciding to act crazy because sometimes they're all over the place. 
Earlier in practice, Kat and I saw two Jeeps collide in the sky. So. That was, that was actually amazing. And like the Jeeps were hovering for a while. <laughs> so anything can really happen here and we want good RNG. So we'll see how it goes. But um, yeah, AJ, if there's more donations, by all means. Oh yeah, we got plenty. We got uh, $50 here, or $25, I'm sorry, from uh, Nina1515 says, ooh, Laura has the best hair physics. Who? Oh yeah, that's what it says. <laughs> don't, don't, don't attack me. Fighting oh, okay. words. That's okay. I, I thought maybe that was her American sister or something. It might be, it might be. And uh, we got a $5 donation from Laura Cruz. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy! <laughs> that that early... might, sorry, that might be a reference to like her original character work. Uh, they might not have been exactly sure. Um, she wasn't always going to be Croft, and I think originally she would have been Cruz. Nice change, in my opinion. Continue. <laughs> <laughs> well, they said early morning air walk. Go Tippy! Oh yeah! Thank you. Another ten dollars from Sabil it says the Laura Croft run at AGDQ 2019 was one of my favorites. Good luck with the run, and thanks GDQ for this awesome event. Thank you. Uh, $50 donation from Keep It Stylin' says, believe it or not, I'm walking on air and I never thought I could feel so free. <laughs> I, I wasn't gonna sing it, sorry. There's no oh. way. Uh, uh, I'm sorry, you don't wanna sing something? Wow, I'm shocked. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if you want me to. By all means, we got time. Mm. All right, let's keep going. Let's no pressure. If somebody drops in a hundred dollar donation for that with those same things, I'll sing it. All right. So, uh, Pika Afro drops in fifteen dollars. Says have to donate for Tomb Raider. Good luck to all the runners. Thank you. Yes. Have a hundred ninety seven dollar donation from. Kester the Jackal says, after an incredible crystal run from Kizarin, I got to put my favorite Pokemon, or my favorite Pokemon towards naming the rival after him. Heck yeah, Umbreon. Heck yeah, Umbreon's cool. Just a reminder, guys, you can keep, you can continue putting in uh, donations towards naming the Pokemon for the upcoming Pokemon Let's Go. So if you want to do that, go ahead and get those donations in now. All right, so coming up, uh, the camera can get a little weird. We are sort of at the end of this uh, bike sequence. Uh, I have to be really careful not to hit these towers. Okay, there we go. Sweet jumps. Yeah, <laughs> sick. Sick, dude. <laughs> um, and I have to be careful here, too, because I can actually fall through, like, the these cracks here, but we didn't, so that's good. <laughs> and that's the end of the, um, the bikes. We made it. We made it, kind of. <laughs> but wait, there's helicopter hair. <laughs> Another quick time event. You cannot skip this one. Um, <laughs> The nice thing, though, is that you can, like, preemptively <laughs> strike the key. <laughs> hey. The shot of her eyes. Yeah. <laughs> that tomfoolery back there. This is what I signed up for. <laughs> but you can preemptively strike the key, and then you don't have to actually time it. So that's pretty nice. I don't think it's the same for, like, Tomb Raider Anniversary, for example. But we are at the lab. And everything's on fire now. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah you guys kind of missed the other part of the train exploding, but... We didn't have time for that, so. All right, let's initiate another air walk here. The fire has an invisible wall. Yeah, there is an invisible wall here. I'm pretty sure the fire also doesn't do anything. <laughs> uh, mm, I'd have to test that, but I don't. I think you're right, actually. <laughs> so these exposed wires can sometimes be kind of scary, but uh, we are going to hit a few of them. I'm just going to quick. Oh, going to try, try to skip this uh, section here. She's being. Uncooperative. Miss Croft, please. Thank you. All right. So we don't have to do the um, rope, because I don't like those ropes. All right. And so here I'm going to take damage on purpose, because it's just a little bit faster. So go into that. And again, here. The heat must be one of them. Have to <laughs> get rid of those. So normally you'd have to do a puzzle in this room, but um, Lara can actually backflip through this door and it will just open. So I'm, I'm going to be hovering over all this 
because this uh, toxic gas is really unforgiving. Um, it does a lot of damage. It does a lot of damage, and I think it has to do with um, V-Sync being off. But... Check out the big gun thing. <laughs> yeah. yeah! The big gun thing. We're not going to get on that big gun thing, but we are on our way to another one, so fear not, friends. Check out that thing. We're not going to use it. <laughs> Look at that big thing that we're not going to use. Avoid it. Go on. <laughs> what a shame. <laughs> All right. So, yeah. I'm <laughs> Yeah, you see how fast. Yeah, that, yeah look, how, look at that. How fast oh, her, her health went down there. So, all right, uh, boss time. So this is kind of like a little, I don't know, it's sort of like Tesla type boss. I have to push all these little like half orbs into their, I don't know, little orb sections. Gotta make like a, an electric circle. Yeah, right. and then it will it will activate it will unlock the barrier that is um, guarding the, the piece that Lara needs. But this guy can be a little bit of a pain because he can stun her with um, sort of like a, almost like a mine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Fortunately, not during the cutscenes. Yeah. Yeah, not during the cutscenes. So the cutscenes here are a little bit long, but what can you do? So yeah, the sword fragment is um, expo yeah. <laughs> it's exposed now, and we just have to get rid of that barrier. So hopefully he doesn't sh knock me out of this uh, gun. Big gun thing. But we'll see <laughs> how it goes, yeah. The boss is right. so cool looking, though. Nice. And, uh, yeah. It's like so, my favorite little ooh. thing. He knocked me over right when I was going to. Oh. Okay, there we go. There nice, we go. Nice. Bad boy. Mean, but pretty. <laughs> All right, so we're coming up on England, which in my opinion is probably the hardest level because there is a lot of RNG. Uh, lots of things can go wrong in England. But they won't, right, guys? No, no not at all. Of course not. not. Marathon luck and all that. <laughs> gonna do it with style and ease. We'll see. Of course. Okay, gonna try to gain enough height so that I can jump over the store. And it's Forklift Chan. Forklift Chan! Forklift Chan. Hi. Hi. <laughs> so Lara has to get on this little forklift uh, to kind of break some walls. I mean, Forklift Chan's really doing all the work. She doesn't get enough credit, really. Yeah, an entire wall. I know. It's like twice her size, and she, she doesn't care. She's strong. We're going Very right, strong. We're going right through. Yeah, so we're going to open the gate here with her. Yeah, who needs it? Portcullis? No big deal. We good. Forklift John. But uh, unfortunately, you guys are going to have to say goodbye. So uh, Already? What? Yeah, I don't, know. It's okay. Oh. Don't be sorry. Bye. 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 Bye, Forklift John. <laughs> All right. You shall be remembered. We, we saved now. I told, I'll, I'll okay. <laughs> I told Catling to remind me to save here because... um. It, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Risky jump here. Yeah, we're going to do another grapple cancel. First Never. try. Let's oh go. Oh, my God. Go. All right. So I have to get, I need to lower my height just a bit so we can fit under here. And then I'm going to be trying to kind of load another section of the level. And it's really scary because there are these huge propellers. <laughs> Yeah. Fire, Whoa. propellers, we'll there's a lot going on. how it goes. Okay, good, perfect. <laughs> okay, cool. So cool. We, got the, we got the next section loaded, and hopefully it doesn't glitch her out, but I'm going to be trying to get through into this section here. I certainly hope so. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Mara, I, I certainly, certainly hope so. <laughs> okay, so uh, you're supposed to be coming from the other side of the gate, so um, it actually puts her on this side if you, if you quit out and load back in. So now we can kind of pretend like we did all of England, even though we didn't. And um, But we did. Yeah, we but we did. did. We but did we did. Well. Don't yeah. you remember that? Forklift Chan was there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We all went out and got ice cream. I mean, it was perfect. Oh, yeah. Take cover. <laughs> take, take, take cover. <laughs> all right. So the, the box RNG was actually really good for this um, level. Normally, or sometimes it can be in a bad position and you have to move it, but ooh, that was close. I'm trying to avoid these guys from shooting me out of the airwalk. There we go. All right. Nice. All yeah, right. this has been there a solid go. England so far, actually. It's actually been a really good England. I've had many runs die here. <laughs> Definitely gets spicy. All right. I'm going to jump over here. And whee! 
<laughs> <laughs> he tried to do a backflip. It wasn't so successful. I feel like these guys just... Hey, that was pretty rude, man. You go for a ride. <laughs> <laughs> hey. <Me>. Oh. <laughs> oh, you, you made him do a double there. Yeah, the double. This is a funny little... I don't know why the enemies act that way, but it's amusing for me. She's just got a really strong role. I'm easily entertained. What can I say? <laughs> all right. <laughs> so that was England. That was a good England. Mm -hmm. And so Laura has all of the pieces except for one right now, and they're talking about it, but we'll, whatever. We'll, we're going to go get it, so... Winnie was on the right. Yeah. Major glow-up. Major glow-up in this game. <laughs> yeah. He's looking nice. He might, be, he might be shaking still, though. Yeah, when he shakes. <laughs> but posture much improved. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Like this to this. So I'm going to be using Airwalk to get up this mountain, and we're going to be doing some forward rolls to kind of get along here. I have, to I have to gain some particular height. Otherwise, I won't be able to get to this section, and I ha otherwise would have to platform, so... I'm just trying to get the uh, perfect amount of height. This should be good. Okay, good. And we got another kind of really scary uh, grapple cancel coming up. So I'm going to be... So this is actually the crash site. Um, so this is where her and her mama were. But I'm going to try to get this uh, grapple cancel. We'll see if I die or not. Okay, here we go. Okay. Yeah, there, yeah, there you go. Got him. Who needs to do all those things? Just air walk. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah, we're going to skip a lot of these enemies too. There's usually like a fight section here, but I'm just going to load the next section and we're going to skip all these guys. But hi, guys. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> and I'm going to try to load in this other section here too. We'll do like a little walk. Oh, okay. So I'm out. Yeah, good. Sometimes you can actually... Nice. Yeah, that was good. Actually, I thought I was in the cave. Um, if, once you're in the cave, you usually can't get out. Um, it's not that much of a time loss, but every second helps. Mm -hmm. Oh, guys. Mm -hmm. Say hi to Face. Where are you? Where is she? Face. Hey. Hey. Yes. Yes. <laughs> oh, she oh, why is she? A little... No, it's okay. Get a little more faces. It's okay, Faith. It's okay, honey. Calm down. We're no, not going to hurt you. Yeah. We're, we're friendly, I swear. We won't roll into you like we did the dogs. <laughs> no. <laughs> you, you won't suffer the same fate. You are safe. <laughs> I was going to make a joke about you won't suffer the same faith, but I don't know where I was going with that. I'm well, sorry, that was on. it. I mean, <laughs> no, no follow-up necessary. No. <laughs> there you go. All right. So um, I'm going to let this play out for a little bit, but... Um, this is basically the first time, uh, as far as I know, that you actually see Lara um, holding a sword in any of the games, which I think is really cool. So she's putting together Excalibur now, and she has uh, the final piece here, and it's happening. <laughs> Whoa. 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 It's fucking. I know. Excalibur reforged. Excalibur reforged. And just like that, we have a sword now. Yep. <laughs> Got Scary it. Scary looking <laughs> too. Oh, yeah. So we're going to be using this sword um, back in Bolivia at that other pedestal. And, uh, oh, oh, whoa. Whoa. well, that's never happened before. <laughs> yeah. That was a strong force. <laughs> she's still getting used to it. She's never used sword magic before. Yeah, I she's, mean, this is all. she's used, usually used to the dual pistols, so. Yeah, it's a learning curve to just suddenly become a sorceress. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so now we're making our way out of Nepal and to the final boss. Yeah. I mean, no. I mean, I'm so confused. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> I don't want it to be over, but also, yay. Yeah, she would normally... Uh, so I asked Tech if we could watch the ending. They said no. 
sad face. Won't want. But um, we'll reenact it. Yeah, we're we're considering <laughs> just doing a full reenaction. Yeah. So whenever you guys want to, I'm I'm gonna be basically putting the sword back in this pedestal, and there's like gonna be explosions and stuff. I mean, you're not gonna see this. So you gotta use your <laughs> imaginations. <here. laughs> there's explosions. Oh, hold on, hold on. Oh, there's Amanda. Hey. James. Hey. <laughs> oh, James. All right, so she's got the, she's got a hold of the demon, and I'm gonna try my best to uh, stun lock him, but he can actually sort of ring me out. Uh, like, I can get knocked out of this arena, which is really scary. I think it's mostly that it happens during the fourth phase. All right, so not bad, stun lock. First phase, done. Yeah, so first phase, done. Okay, okay. I don't see him. Hello, sir. Hmm. All right. Please, please sit still. <laughs> Behave. Yeah, you can lose a lot of time to this. All right, that was a good stun lock. And I have to do this two more times. Come on. All right. Get in on this. I don't want to get too close to this edge. I'm going to back up. <laughs> Yeah. yeah. Last phase now. Yeah. Be first. So we just got one more phase, and then no. uh, it'll come up on time when you see sort of it change to a cinematic camera. But I gotta, I gotta get his health down first. <laughs> come on. All right. This is kind of scary because I'm a little far away from him, and he's really pushing me far back. All right. Come on. All right. And time. We're actually very 10 minutes on Earth. Oh, wow. All right. So anyway, guys, uh, that was something. That was Tomb Raider <laughs> legend. Um, <laughs> thank you guys so much for having me here at uh, SGDQ. I, uh, I really appreciate it. And um, thank you for donating if you have already. Uh, big thanks to, to Maxi, Lobes, uh, Catlink, and Nikasaur on my couch. Uh, you guys are awesome. Uh, AJ for doing the donations. Thank you. All of you guys who are, were awake for the run. Thank yeah. you. Everybody watching at home. Um, and I, uh, <laughs> I just want to say a really uh, special shout out to my niece, Charlotte. It is her birthday today. Um, and I don't get to see her. She's turning three. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday. Happy birthday, Charlotte. Maybe you'll watch this sometime in the future. But um, I think that we're good. So thank you so much for having me. Oh, wait. You want to say it? No, wait, 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 wait. Where, where, where is my mother? <laughs> Come find me on twitch.tv slash smoothoperative and I'll, I'll help you find her. <laughs> <laughs>